I'm Mark Schneider, you're Mark Schneider Classics, and today I gotta undo all of this and redo it again. Uh, this is my 1969 Silverline camper, and we did the top and put it on. We were starting to get all this put and ready to go, um, and then I went and learned this mechanisms. All four of them are backwards, so I gotta take the top off, take these apart, and. Uh, put them all around and then put it all back on. So let's get started on that because I gotta get going on it. Taking control, taking control. I've had enough of this. Been losing my soul, losing my soul. Time to get a grip. I'm taking control, taking control. Now that we have the top off. Go to each one of these, take them off, and move them to the opposite sides. I'm a little less grumpy, just, just a little. I have tried many, many things and I made the camper a little bit worse because I broke some stuff. I'm trying to get this mechanism down and we've swapped it and everything. I mean, it's a lot better than sitting way up. I, I bet there's a way to do it. I don't really, I'm, I'm done. I'm done figuring it out. So we're going on to the classic hack. <laughs> Yeah, what he said. I went and got some six inch aluminum flashing and we're just gonna do that. It'll be fine. Don't worry about it. So it doesn't look bad, but I can tell you one thing, I am not good at building campers, nor have I ever said I am, and uh, uh, it is an experience I am not the most pleased with, but you know what, 
that protects rain. It's fully set up and it still covers. It, it like is like perfect height for what it needs to be. So we'll end the video here today and call it a day. But this has been frustrating me. I think I've met my match of uh, learning. We're gonna buy one next time, right? Maybe.